So I'm back at Kenwood Rod Shop in Fayetteville, Georgia, and this is what we have left of the Plymouth right now. The body is off, it's headed over to Brian's paint and body, and now is when Randy has to do some serious work. This is all the heavy hitting as we get all the frame stuff ready, uh, send it off to powder coat. Uh, we did a lot of work on the firewall to make sure everything fits here for the blueprint 408. This thing is gonna, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Got the T56 six speed for American powertrain with quick time bell housing. Uh, everything's going in great so far. Now it's just working on the height stuff, getting the Mustang 2 front end exactly where we want it, uh, fabbing up the heights rear end too, doing a four link back there. I just, I can't believe it. It's, it's just so big, this build, and it's happening so fast, and I can't wait for you to come see it on the power tour. Without Summit Racing, this project really doesn't exist because I'm just, just a guy sitting here holding on to nothing. The killer thing is we ordered everything we need. We can call people, actually know what they're doing on the phone there. It's amazing. Because when I say, hey, I need a column, but I'm not totally sure, and they say, all right, well, here's what you should measure. Here's what you need to decide. Do you want tilt? Do you want turn signals? All that stuff. We're using a really cool Flaming River column. Uh, we're going to get uh, American Powertrain. We're working out how we're going to do our shifting on this beautiful T56 six-speed. Because let's be honest, with 445 horsepower, out of this Blueprint 408, I mean, I could have gone with an automatic, but what fun is that? You know, if I'm drifting my kids into school sideways in a 53 Plymouth with Summit Racing on the side, I just think, you know, I should be able to catch second gear. So, uh, yeah, this is really fun. We're getting all this stuff figured out. We got the Heights front end Mustang 2 kit, doing a power rack on that. It's going to be really nice. I mean, this is my wife's car. I've made a couple jokes because really it's like my dream car for my wife. So she's picking out all the colors, but it's still going to get there. So yeah, this is nice. You know that quick time bell housing working? This is going to be good. I mean, I should put seats in the steering wheel in here too. It's a guy with a dream. Oh, hey, no, it's 53. Yeah. 40, 445 horsepower. It's pretty cool. So on my 53 Plymouth Wagon project, we're using the Summit Racing 9-inch Ford rear end. We're going to have a Detroit True Track locker in there, so we'll have a nice limited slip. We're using strange axles, will wood brakes all the way around, but uh, Kenwood Rod Shop's fabbing up all the four-link for it right now. Uh, i got a nice set of coilovers that came with it, so we'll run those. And then once we get everything just the way we like it, uh, Randy will strip everything down, we'll clean the whole frame up do all the strengthening that we want on that. We might add another cross member. We gotta kinda see how it all looks. And then we will powder coat this bad boy and get it back underneath the Plymouth. You can come see the car on the Power Tour. You won't miss it. I'll be there driving it. My 49 Chevy step van we built with Summit will be there too. So come out, come say hi. Check this thing out.